Woo, we have not vlogged my day in a life. So we got ready uh, and now I'm on my way to Dufresne, Dufresne. Um, they are having a brunch, which I cannot partake in, but I brought my food. Um, I know that they're making me something special, I guess, but I, I honestly just cannot eat it. So, um, I'm hoping my friend does me a solid and eats it for me. Um, if not, I'll just take it home and put it back in my container. Um, but we're on our way. I hope I'm not running too, too late. I hope I, like, get there soon. Um, a little bit panicking because I hate being late, especially to, like, events like this. Um, so yeah, just keep your eyes on the road and follow the flow. Um, but yeah, really excited to show you guys what's going on. <laughs> Say hi. <laughs> hi, little guy. I can see you. <laughs> so we're here. We're here at Dufresne. It's a mix and mingle. Could be class. So we are going to change from cuddling up to um, hosting and entertaining both our friends and our little ones. And so we thought it'd be a perfect opportunity to partner with KitchenAid. Um, they really focus on um, creating a space um, with new designs, like really thoughtful so that if you're out at the um, farmer's market, you have a beautiful fridge to put it in that displays it beautifully and really just making moments. Um, and that aligns with your frame so perfectly. Um, and so when we thought about doing this event, it's always, you know, we started as a small company uh, with mom and pop, uh, Doug and Eva Dufresne. And when we look at who's around us today, we have... So this pot here is for poaching the eggs and there's some vinegar in there that just helps the egg kind of firm up it reacts with the white when it hits the water. Um, and you want it to just start to simmer, like not bubble. And one kind of myth, a lot of videos that you see will say to stir the water so that the egg swirls around when you put it in. I don't like that at all. I want the egg just to gently go in and just stay together and then don't touch it until it's cooked in about five minutes. Um, so that's the good thing with induction, it's really quick. I just put this pot on like two minutes ago and it's almost starting to boil. Um, so, start with egg yolks. Uh, five egg yolks, so one pound of butter. I'm also going to add some uh, white wine and shallot reduction. You can put other things in there. You can put some like black pepper, some fresh herbs, things like that. You can kind of flavor your hollandaise however you want. Um, I'm also going to add some fresh lemon and a little bit of sriracha. I know it's not the and it's just scrambled eggs. You can't do anything like that. And then they'll try and keep going and add the butter to the scrambled eggs and then they get mad and they throw the whole thing in the sink and then they come see us and it's going to take a few minutes. Um, so I'm just going to whisk it. It's gonna, it'll take a little while. You'll see it'll eventually it'll start to thicken up and it'll just get foamy. Um, you don't have to go crazy, you're just trying to keep it moving so that it's not sitting right at the bottom where the heat's coming from. Maybe she can get cookies from here. Um,
so cute.
Jasper's definitely over that cupcake cookie. I just like put too much. If you would like to take your icing base home, they do freeze really well. When you take them out of the freezer, you'll just have to massage the color back together. That's what you want to do.